ocean called Pacific. There's a mixed up group of creatures who are really quite horrific. Stitched together with whatever God was found or could be proud. Be invented in the bowels of a lab. Spliced. They have all been spliced. Half baked and diced. And regurgitated. By some crazy doctor. Who went the loose. And now you pay the price. They have all bits of hip hop, tops of lava. of Amazotopia. Now, nobody has ever met a native Amazotopia. But based on my research and imagination, they look very different from us. They dance all night long to Amazopolka. And they live in a beautiful green city. It's my dream to explore Amazotopia, but how can I get there? In the Snuggle Booster Mark I, of course. See? Easy. <laughs> oh, boy! Wish me luck! Three, two, one. No, my engines have failed to. <laughs> Okay? That was a big one. Sometimes stuff like this happens to explorers. Next time, pack a parachute. I did. <laughs> Fuzzy. He's not much of an explorer, really. More of an exploder. <laughs> really? Okay. Okay, forget it. Uh, if Fuzzy won't stop until he reaches a Mazotopia, then why don't we help him get there? Or we could try my way. <laughs> yeah, I like Perry's idea better. <laughs> All right, way to go! Hey! You can do it! <laughs> Take the parachute! You guys came to watch me go? Of course. We know you're gonna make it to Amazon Tapioca this time. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> we made you a helmet! But I can't see! Ready for lunch? Three! Princess! Two! Now! One! Everything looks so strange. Can it be? I made it! I made it to Amazotopia! Hooray! Hooray! Hello, strange traveler. I am Hoselord Zungofish, 
And this is Boxatron 800. Uh, beep, boop, beep, boop. Hello. <gasps> Amazotopians. <clears throat> I'm Fuzzy Snuggums. I've come to explore your island. Huzzah! Our town is completely different from your town. Beep, boop, beep, boop. It's green. Greetings, explorer. Ah, yes, sir. Welcome. Oh, who are you? Uh, this is a tramalama ding dong. And, uh. Beep. Stinky head. Beep. Stinky head. Big nose. <laughs> That's his name, Boop. Stinky head. Why I am? I thought all arguments in the Mesotopia were solved with bread fights. And so they are. Ready, Stinky Head? Boxatron? What? And it's time to return to your own people. But I haven't seen an Amazotopian rumble dance. I hear they go on all night. All night, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah! Jump it up! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Jump it up! About time. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Stop. Get up. <sighs> Finally. Okay, I'm going to bed. Where are you going? Isn't it time for your festival of pointless suffering? Weren't we already doing that? I'm gonna regret this. I can't tell you how happy I am to be an Amazotopian right now. It's not so bad. Oh, yeah. It's great. <laughs> Is that part of your ritual? Um, not exactly. The Tramalama Ding Dong isn't feeling so well. Beep, boop, beep, boop. Can I have hers? <laughs> <laughs> Look, you've really seen everything there is to see here in Amazotopia. Time to go home. Seriously. But I'm not done exploring. Oh, yes, you are. <laughs> Have a nice trip home. But I can't see. Bye. Bye. Oh, boy. Oops, Princess Butterfingers. <laughs> How was your trip to Amazotopia? You're done with exploring now, right? No more rockets and all that? Yeah, I guess so. We did it! <laughs> Wait a second. What? Didn't you hear Patricia? We did it! Sheesh. Didn't Fuzzy seem sad to you? Sad, happy... What's the difference? Hey, Fuzzy. What's wrong? You did it. You went to Amazotopia, met some crazy Amazotopians, and... Uh... I know it was you guys. What? How? Beep, boop, beep, boop. Busted. But if you don't want me to explore anymore, 
And I guess I won't. Hey, Andre, we didn't help Fuzzy. He broke his cute little exploring heart. Helped him, broke his heart. What's the difference? <laughs> We know you really want to reach Amazotopia. So we decided to help you explode. Help you explode! Right, on right. You bet. All right. We support, we support you! Support you. Okay. For real this time! Thank you. This really means... Three, two, one, go! earlier. Ha-ha! Through the rhino's window, the jetpack will soar. On goes the control car, and he stops me no more. The mayor is my puppet, and I run his mind. It's the best plan ever. That freak town is mine. <laughs> well, are you kidding me? It's a great plan. It even rhymes. Now, Octocat, jetpack me. Yes! Let's get jetpacking! Ooh, I think I'll make that my new catchphrase. <laughs> jetpacking! No! No, no, no! Leave it open! <laughs> now to... Um, jetpacking? Meow. Meow. I know I was only gone for two seconds. No, I didn't have time for that collar. It, it's just, it's been so hard recently. I mean, my hypno hat was a total failure. And I don't even want to talk about the rocket skates. What? It seemed like a good plan at the time. I know, I know I need to get back out there. Uh, maybe after a bath. No, I'm too sad for your octo cupcakes. Uh. Hey, will you just don't stop that? I, I'll detub when I'm good and ready. Look, you want the island taken over, you go do it, okay? Leave me to soak in my bathtub of failure. Octocat? What are you up to? Oh no, you poor evil thing! Aw, you're welcome! Oh. Meow. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it's cold out there, and I'm wrinkly. 
I need my robe! <sighs> Gone swimming? For a minion, she's not acting very miniony. Uh, let's see what the only people more pathetic than me are doing today. Ha, must be art. Finally, a proper job for that oversized rhino. Wait, why is he doing that? Everyone's acting like zombies. <gasps> Control collars? They've all been turned into hyper-efficient mind slaves. <laughs> Yay, rocks! Well, okay, not everyone. Octocat, some audacious fool is using all the mutants to build something in the center of town. We must discover what it is. Come now! You're busy? With what? Mrow? What, what do you mean, Mrow? You know I don't approve of your loud music, young lady. Fine, I'll do it myself. Too medical. Too formal. Too weird. Perfect! Everyone trusts a cowboy. Howdy, I'm a straight shooter. Yeehaw, and so forth. It's too small to be a doomsday laser, but too big to be an Omega Ray. I've heard that meow before. <coughs> Octocat? But I, I feed her. I, I clean her little box. I dress her in sweaters. <coughs> Traitor! I'll destroy you! <coughs> Princess! Hello! Uh, don't worry, this isn't a hypno hat like last time. And about that, I I'm sorry. <laughs> Fine, Octocat. Betray me and suffer the consequences. Come, my minion! Right, I'm out of minions. Hmm. <laughs> now what? Now we do the same thing with trees. <gasps> A cowboy! Quiet! Why aren't you two wearing control collars and slaving away with the others? We volunteered to help, but Octocat said they were full. Well, I'm not. Consider yourselves my new minions. Do we get hats? I... why? Well, sure. Hooray! <laughs> Can we have mustaches? No. Can we twirl yours? Fine. Oh, hello, fellow explorers. looking for help. My new minions and I have destroyed your plan. You're done, you weight-limbed betrayer. Yes, you! Trying to take over this town for yourself in my moment of weakness. I'll show you, Mrow! Wait a second. I'm confused. You see, we started the episode with the ending, then backtracked to the beginning, which brought us back to the same ending that we started with in the beginning. Oh! I don't get it. Yeah! <laughs> 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 
Oh, fine. Ninja smoke. <laughs> Princess Free! Fantastic. Now go ape somewhere else. <sighs> Smarty Pants! Princess Smash! Ninja smoke! <laughs> Please don't beg, unless you're begging for destruction. Your betrayal has a price, Octocat, an ultimate price. <laughs> It's beautiful. Meow. Meow. You did all this. Took over the town. Built the statue. For, for me? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'll never doubt you again. Not even when I'm sure you finished the milk and put the cotton back in the fridge. <laughs> <clears throat> Enough of that. No sense in wasting more time. Now let's start oppressing. Welcome back, my minion. Hey, what about us? Oh, yes. Uh, you two are fired. Uh, give back those hats. Smarts! If you come down now, I'll only stomp you to oblivion. If I gotta come up there... Oh, boy! Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. See, I, I took off everyone's control collars. Oh, and I might have put a fusion detonator on the statue. It was covered in a tarp. I thought it was a weapon or something. 